Hi guys, welcome to my videos. So guys, today in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create an audit log retention policy in your Office 365. So before I proceed further, if you have not already subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and subscribe right now. So guys, in front of you, I have opened the interface of uh, or web page of whatever you say, or Office 365 Compliance Center. You can navigate it easily like on your admin center, just click on Compliance and it's going to open it for you. Here, if you uh, go to the solution section, you have this audit option. Click on audit. So you have new search creation uh, and then search and audit iteration policy. So you want to create audit iteration policy. So let's go to audit iteration policy. Let's create one. Let's put a name test policy. Okay. Test. Please choose users or record types to apply this policy to and for how long you want to retain. Again, based on your license and other packages, it uh, may uh, cost you or something. And then a uh, priority, like let's say you have multiple policies, which priority should take over? That is really important. And what are the things you want to, what are the record types you want to do? You can do it over here. It's simple. But you got to be very careful like SharePoint, SharePoint content operation, SharePoint field and you can select multiple. SharePoint file operation list of for SharePoint there are so many. Huh? You can do and then you save it and it gets applied over here. So this is just test so I'm not going to do but I think I have uh, given you the idea. So thanks for watching this guys and please subscribe to the channel. Thank you.